what is going on everybody so this is going to be how to hose your system in five minutes or less all right actually it's how to fix some deprecation warnings i ran into i've uh, been getting them for a while but i don't know today i had time to kind of dig in and look through how to fix that so running a update we see that the key is stored in the legacy trusted.gpg key ring, uh, and that is deprecated. So after digging around a little bit, I went ahead and just went to here, and we can see that the keys are stored in this trusted.gpg file. And I decided just to try to uh, remove that file and see if Linux would be helpful and just rebuild those for me. All right, now when we sudo apt get update, well, uh, we get some different errors uh, that the keys are not uh, present. So, oops, and we will need to add those back. So we just need to run this command for each of the public keys that are missing. Uh, here's the first one, and we can see that that imported. We'll just go ahead and do that for each one. So this one here, and I'm going to control shift V to paste that. And I think there were just two missing. Okay, so now we're back to where we started. So, let's see. We need to find a way to move these keys and uh, make Linux happy. So, what we are going to do is actually export those to uh, the key rings directory. And if we look here, we have key rings. And you can see I've got a few in there already. Uh, so to do that, we just need to go ahead and I've got a command I can copy here. And I'll put these down in the, in the description as well. I love Terminator, but when it goes bad, it throws me off a bit. There we go. Uh, so I'm just going to run this again so we can see which ones we're missing. All right, so it looks like graphics drivers. So if we do uh, sudo app key list, Looks like we are missing graphics drivers. So it'd be this one here. And I'm just going to call that uh, graphics drivers when we export it. And we just need to grab uh, the last eight characters here and remove the space. Control Shift V. That space doesn't matter, but that one may. And that that's fine. Uh, that little app key deprecated. I think that was just a delay. Uh, and we can check that. I'm going to go to uh, the key rings directory and make sure that that exported. OK, good. That one's there. And the other one we needed was uh, OBS Studio. That's a little odd because it looks like that one's already there, but uh, we can just double check. So we'll just 
run that again. Uh, we already have OBS project dash OBS. I'm just going to say uh, OBS. Oh, it doesn't really matter as long as we remember the name. Uh, call this OBS Studio. I don't know if those are different or not. I need to remember to change these characters here. That. Again, that error is fine. Now when we do sudo app get update, we will get a different error. Well, the keys are still there, so I was wrong. We get the same error. Uh, but what we're going to do is we're going to uh, go to the additional repositories and let's see. So that graphics driver one, we just need to edit that. And I believe we will need sudo. And right here, we just need to tell it where that key is. Well, we need to tell it uh, the architecture, which is going to be AMD 64 and Let's see, we're going to, I think it's key ring. Actually, you know what, I can check another one here real quick. Oh, signed by. I guess I could have just copied that. Signed by. And that's going to be the same location, but with a different name. And what did we call that one? We call that graphics drivers dot All right, that looks good. I'm going to control X, Y to save, and then enter to keep the same name. And we will also need to do OBS. Oops, not in that window. And again, we'll probably need sudo. Oh, and we want to open that with nano. Okay. Oh, okay, I think I know what's going on here. So I am on Linux Mint 21.1, uh, which is uh, built on top of Ubuntu Jammy. So actually, I don't think I even... need Focal anymore, so I'll just get rid of that. And... Let's try again. All right, no errors. So hopefully that helps some of you out. I don't know, that took a very long time for me to figure out, longer than it probably should have. And hopefully that will stay the same for a while in Linux Mint, but Hey, security, security. Uh, so we just always have to roll with it. But that's all I have for this one. And I will see you in another video. Thanks for watching.